Hi guys, welcome to another podcast of MrLopezClasses.com. We are going to continue in our class of uh, DC current, basic electricity. And uh, the question today is, what boat is more efficient? A boat configured in 24 volts or a boat configured in 12 volts? Let me explain something. The efficiency can not be determined in terms of the voltage. In other words, ah, oh, the boat 24 volts is more efficient than the 12 volts? No, the efficiency probably is the same. It's different if you ask, what is the advantage of a 24 volts configuration, 24 volts wiring in comparison with 12 volts? What is the advantage? And yes, we can check some advantage of one system in comparison with the other one. Let me explain what is the meaning of that. The question is, my boat configured it in 24 volts. The power is higher in comparison with the boat configured it in 12 volts. The answer is not. The power is the same. Yes, my friend, the power is the same. Let me, let me calculate. We are going to do a simple example. Uh, we are going to create a battery bank with two batteries. Each battery is 12 volts, 100 amps. Once again, each battery is 12 volts, 100 amps. And we are going to create a configuration, parallel configuration. We are going to connect both batteries in parallel. The positive with the positive and the negative with the negative. How much is the output voltage and the output intensity in that configuration, parallel configuration? The output voltage is connected in parallel will be 12 volts. And the, the output amps is 100 and 100 is 200 amps. That's correct? Okay. The output voltage will be 12 volts and the intensity increase is 100 plus 100 is 200. Okay. Now I am going to calculate the power for that configuration in parallel. The power is, remember the ohm low power is equal to voltage times intensity. In this particular case, the power is 12 volts times 200 is 2400 watts. Perfect. Okay. Remember, it's 2400 watts. Now we are going to do the same with series. I have the same two batteries of 12 volts, 100 amps, and now I am going to connect both batteries in series. Ah, the positive of the first one connected with the negative of the second one. Ah, and now in between the output positive and the output negative, how much is the voltage? The voltage is 24 volts because they are connected in series. And what about the intensity, the amps? Okay, the amps is 100. Ah, okay, in this particular case, I have 24 volts, 100 amps, because both batteries are connected in series, each battery of 12 volts and 100 amps. Okay, I have 24 volts and 100 amps. What is the power for that, for that series configuration? The power is 24 volts, times 100 is 2400 watts. Ah, the power is the same. Doesn't matter if the configuration is parallel or series. It's exactly the same. Oh, Mr. Lopez, what happened if I connect not two batteries, I connect three batteries, four batteries. It's exactly the same. Try to do the exercise in a paper. It's exactly the same. The power is the same. Ah, okay. What is the advantage of the configuration in 24 volts? Okay. We are going to refresh quickly. Uh, in, the, in, the, in the series configuration, power is equal to 24 times 100. What happened in parallel? Ah, the power is equal to 12 volts times 200. In what configuration you have more amount of amps? In the parallel configuration. Yes or not? Okay. In the parallel configuration, you have 12 volts, 200 amps. In the series configuration, you have 24 volts, 100 amps. Ah, what is the meaning of that? Ah, in parallel configuration, I need a bigger cable, thicker cable, because I need move more amps. Ah, in series configuration, I have only 100 amps. I can use smaller wires, thinner wires. That's the advantage. When I configure it in 24 volts, I can use smaller wires, thinner wires because I move less amps for the same power. Exactly, my friend. 
This is the advantage of the 24 volts configuration in comparison with the 12 volts configuration. You enjoy that explanation? I hope you enjoy that explanation. If you want more details about uh, this uh, explanation, you can check the chapter three of uh, my electrical book. There are a lot of episodes when I explain that configuration, uh, the 24 volts or 12 volts, and what is the advantage. Check my website, www.mrlopezclasset.com, and uh, you find a lot of episodes related with that topic. I hope you enjoy this explanation. Good luck.